Hello guys, um, welcome back. I'm not where I used to be, and I know that sounds strange. Hey, what'd you do? Well, I thought I was recording, but I wasn't, and I'm back now. I mean, because I realized it, and I was like, oh crap, I better start recording. So, I did lose, unfortunately, a large amount of stuff, and all of, almost all of my meat was eaten. Uh, so the only meat I have right now is the meat that I recovered on the way. But, bright side is <laughs> I got marble and uh, nightmare fuel. Which means I'm one, I'm kind of close now to being able to turn Chester into Shadow Chester. Which is, in my opinion, the best. I mean, I don't really store food inside Chester, so I would haven't I wouldn't have a need for making him into a snow Chester. But definitely, Shadow Chester is a necessity because he gains like either three or six slots, but he gains a lot of slots. I'm pretty sure it's just three. But I'm I want a Chester who can hold a lot of items. And never again am I going to trust Pangles, like ever. Because that was horrible. See, I thought if I hit him while they were sleeping, they wouldn't all wake up. But apparently, no, they all wake up. And I'm walking in the wrong direction. So now we have to do something about our sanity. And something about our health. Which are both at crisis here. So... Do you have any wood in you, Chester? No, you don't. That's a problem. Take out that trunk, see it's going bad already. Now let's make a puffy vest. Puffy vest. Boom! Crackalaka. We got a puffy vest. Now we're not gonna be catching a cold for a long time now. Now we're back into a almost food crisis and a sanity crisis. A sanity crisis is what's most concerning because I don't want to go crazy and I don't want to get nightmare fuel yet. Now what I found best to do is take off these and then sleep. So that way you're not wasting the puffy vest or the beaver hat. And then you put them back on. Now, why did you just eat all your meat right there? Because I'm gonna go make more meat. Dodge that better. Crack 
correction, need to dodge that better. Well, I'm finally finding a use for these pigs, because honestly, these pigs have been no help. Like, at all. And by that, I'm being very serious. Like, they have offered no help. Now, why am I continuing to kill them? Because... I need to. Make boards. No, 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 come on. Yes. There you go, now I'm, I have four meat. Why did you say you have four meat? Oh yes, because I don't trust myself anymore to do anything right. So... Oh, you need a press hacitator. Presty hatinator. Well, I just made all these boards for no reason then. That stinks, you didn't need that before. I was gonna make that so that way I wouldn't have to worry about dying. What was that? What? That means we wasted a whole lot of time just doing nothing really, except gaining tons of meat. Well, I wouldn't call that wasting time actually. I mean, <clears throat> Gaining meat is something that needs to be done. But all that wood, on the other hand, was kind of a waste. I shouldn't have needed to waste all that time. Hey, we, we, we recovered a decent amount of sanity loss. We're now not totally crazy now. I mean, we're still pretty crazy, but we're at least not hearing voices anymore. Ah, the things to do, the things to do is get a new spear. Uh, throw that piece of junk away. 
How are you? You're almost just as bad. How are you? You're pretty cruddy as well. Where's my flint? If I have any. You have one piece of flint in you. How lucky. Need grass. Great, we got a uh, batlisk. Uh, now, why am I saying great? Is we get guano. And even though we can't make anything really out of guano, we can use it as fertilizer and it works way better than uh, using poop. So, I think if you put like one piece of guano, it for instantly makes a plant grow. Are you in beef flow season? I don't think you are. Even if you were, it wouldn't matter because I would still be welcomed as part of your herd. Due to the fact that I am wearing my beef flow hat. I'm not going to pick up your poop anymore. I don't really have a need for the poop at the moment. Kind of just really need the grass. Now, if last time I checked is correct, we can get a lot of grass from this area. gonna sleep so that way I can assure my sanity is gonna be in good condition. And I forgot to take off my articles of clothing. And as you can see I paid the price. Now it, that's at 67%. Hmm. up. Now, if this is going to lead me to the Hound Mounds, I'm going to say uh, no Qualifant, no thank you, and I'm just going to leave, uh, because I really don't, am not in the position to battle Hounds. And uh, there came Spring. Well, better start getting Umbrellas ready. I mean, I still have to be like precautious due to the fact that you know I can still freeze it's still pretty cold outside for the first few days of spring but at least winter's over that means no deer clops oh, big sigh of relief but see there's still snow here so that's how you can tell still is winter so we must still be careful But hey, now our garden's gonna be grown. So now we actually have a need to collect seeds. And see, now it's snowing again. See, this is what's confusing. But see, the, look. 
few of them are leafy again. And see, look, now snow's building up on them. What's up with this? What's up with that? Man. I'm gonna have to build a thermer, thermal measurer, as it is called. See, it looks like the ground is getting white splotches again. It looks like it's gonna snow all over again. Still freezing cold. Now I'm going to make that just because I want to be ready for when it does get into real time spring. So it says it's definitely raining, but that's because it's snowing right now. I'm gonna get an umbrella up real quick, and I can't, because I need silk. If it isn't freaking silk. Ugh. I hate silk. Because I'm having so much problem with silk right now, in this playthrough. Like, until that spider den grows to stage 3, and I can destroy it, and kill it, and then move it over here. It's really just a pain in its position. It's so far away. It's at a bad distance, I guess you would say. Well, I might as well get a birdcage up, and you still have monster meat in you, which is kind of nasty. What have you been eating, Chester? Now, I know it takes two of those. And... Nope. And it takes... Six gold. Why do we have to make this out of gold? Why can't we just make it out of flint? And it takes two seeds as well. But, you know, we don't have any. So... I think this still has like, I'm pretty sure it only goes down by 20 each time, so I'm pretty sure we have two more uses out of that. That's nice. I like that. That's effective. Now, I do know like some of the best clothes to stay cool in the summer. Uh, that being the, uh, it's not the summer fest. I know that. It used to be the Summerfest, but it's not anymore. It's now the floral shirt, and that takes three papyrus, three silk, and five cactus flowers. Now, that's expensive. That is, for right now in this world, pretty expensive because we have, like, no silk at all. And then these, I don't even know how to get. So, I mean, I can imagine you need a cactus? Uh, where are the cactuses on this world? Oh no, the desert's up here. Now we got tons of cactus up here, but I don't know if like you need to find a special cactus or if they only grow it in like a certain season. I don't know anything about cactus. 
And I'll have to end this episode right after this. Because it's getting a bit lengthy. But we didn't really get too much done, to be quite honest. Besides getting this puffy vest, which was super useful. And getting, like, what looks like it, almost getting close to spring. I mean, it, I don't even know what season we're in. <laughs> Like we got, we got snow on the ground, and it says it's freezing, but it's not like thick snow. You can see the ground, and it was raining not too long ago. Now objectives I hope to achieve next episode is um, collecting more silk, and if that is now a level three, break that and move it somewhere over here. Like I'll probably. Uh, clear the forest right here like the whole forest right there and just put this spider den right there it'll make it so much easier so much more um, so much more easier see that or I'll put it right there right above the cocoon I think I'll put it right there it's easier because not much clearing and it'll just be overall easier and if I can go down here again and move that guy up there with him so that way we'll have to, like move that guy instead of being right there he'll be put right here so one right one spider down here one spider down up there and I think that'll be very effective and after that I'm you know making sure I collect silk and get an umbrella ready just in case spring does come uh, because I want to be aware. And... What? Well, like, comment, and subscribe, guys, and peace out.